Let's take a clear-eyed look at the challenges facing French and English Bulldogs today. There's a growing concern that our current approaches, while well-intentioned, may be leading us astray. Breeders, in their pursuit of what they believe to be the ideal Bulldog, are inadvertently pushing the breed towards more extreme physical traits. We're seeing an emphasis on shorter muzzles, heavier bone structure, and excessive skin folds. While these features may be visually striking and align with certain interpretations of breed standards, they often contribute to significant health issues. Dogs with extremely short muzzles frequently struggle with breathing difficulties, while those with excessive skin folds are prone to chronic skin problems. The trend towards heavier bone structure can lead to joint stress and mobility issues. These exaggerated traits, though sometimes prized in show rings, can seriously compromise the dog's quality of life and overall well-being. Breed registries and clubs play a major role. Their standards, which emphasize certain physical characteristics, can encourage breeders to prioritize appearance over function. The desire for a stocky body or a very short muzzle, for example, can lead to structural issues and respiratory problems. There's also the matter of genetic diversity. As we narrow our breeding selections based on specific health tests, we risk reducing the overall gene pool. This could potentially increase the likelihood of other inherited disorders down the line. It's a complex situation without easy answers. We're trying to improve bulldog health, but our methods may be creating unintended consequences. Moving forward, we need to carefully consider how to balance health, breed characteristics, and genetic diversity. This isn't about assigning blame. It's about recognizing the current state of affairs and thinking critically about our breeding practices. By addressing these issues head on, we have the opportunity to secure a healthier future for the bulldog breed. I appreciate many dogs built to the extreme of breed standards, as their exaggerated features can be visually striking and appealing. However, I'm also realistic about the challenges these dogs may face, and am fully prepared to address any health issues that arise from their unique builds. My concern is that many bulldog owners, particularly those with modern French and English bulldogs, may not be ready for the level of care and attention these dogs often require due to their extreme physical traits. These are just my thoughts as a passionate bulldog lover, not an expert. I've been observing the breed for years, and I'm concerned about the direction we're heading. It seems like we're pushing for more extreme features in bulldogs, and I worry that it's not in their best interest. From what I've seen, the very short muzzles, heavy bodies, short backs, and excessive wrinkles that are often celebrated can lead to real health problems for these dogs. I might be right, or I might be off base, but I believe it's crucial for all bulldog enthusiasts to think critically about these issues. What are your thoughts? Do you agree or disagree? I'd love to hear your perspective. If you're interested in more discussions like this about our beloved Bulldogs, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. You'll find the links in the description below. Together, we can work towards ensuring a healthy future for these amazing breeds.